welcome. Thank you. And I said that, why the name Heiss? Do you want me to give you the backstory? Give you the backstory. Oh, okay. I, I, I won't know. <laughs> what is the backstory? Uh, I took the name from my secondary school. I, you know, they've been calling like, they've been calling me Ice. It, Ice? it was normally spelled like I-C-E. Okay. But I was like, growing up, I have to improvise changing the spelling. Okay. Yeah, different spelling and the same pronunciation. Ice. Okay, it's ice. So it's all heist. It's heist. But <laughs> okay. <laughs> like it's like the spelling. The H is silent. Yeah, H Y S. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So it's ice. Yeah, ice. Okay. Thank you very much because <laughs> I w- I'm here saying heist, heist. I'm sure someone is like, hey, does she have a problem with H? You know. <laughs> so good to have you. Thank you. How long have you been around? Ah, I just landed. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite long. You just landed today. Mm-hmm. Oh really? Yeah. And how are you feeling the Ghana breeze? I mean, Ghana is always yeah. The, Ghana, the OG, is, Ghana you know? is cool. Yeah. You know? <laughs> I like the breeze and everything. Do you want to go back to Nigeria? I'll go back definitely now, but not now. <laughs> ah, your brother he's here. Oh, this is your semi-Nigerian <laughs> brother. That means he doesn't want to leave. He loves it here. Uh, I can't oh. see that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So let's talk about you and your music. I mean, when did you find out that this is something you'd wanted to do? at a professional level. I'm sure sometimes you talk with a lot of things yep. and then you finally get that eureka moment and say that this is it. I'm going to do this full time. Okay. So yeah, it's been a minute since I was like in secondary school because okay. I'm always this guy. I, you always come outside in class, stand in front of class, like I'm seeing and everybody will be watching. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm always that guy. But, but I didn't take it serious because I was schooling then. Mm-hmm. So, but I dropped my first official song like 2020. Okay. That was when I became serious with music and I took it personal. Mm. Okay. Yeah. And so, what was the journey like for you from 2020? I was, I was, it's not smooth though. It's not, <laughs> <laughs> nothing comes easy. Yeah. Everything, ah, there is like a lot of bad road on the road, like going That's there. Okay. I mean, I just kept, I just pushing. Yeah, yeah. It's not easy. But it's not easy it's until you push. get that one major song that puts you out there. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But I still pushing though. Yeah. So, <laughs> what is that major song that put you out there? Was it Ogeji? or there was something? There yeah, was there another was, track before that. Yeah, there that. was another track titled Vanilla. Vanilla. That was like my first, my first viral track. Okay, this yeah. was in what year? I think last year. This is last year. Can you give us like a? My pretty Isabella, ah. and my you see that sometimes you know the song and you don't know the artist. Oh, oh the you song, know, I know the song. <laughs> I know it. I play a lo- ar- around a lot of songs. So, uh. um, so I would, there are sometimes I would just get hooked on one song. I may not know the artist. I will know the name. Now you know the I, artist. Yes, now I know it. And, and it's good to know the artist. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. great. Um, congratulations to you. So Thank you yeah. did that one and then put you out there yeah. and then came in Ogiji with your other um, guys, team yeah. members as well. It um, just happened. It just happened. <laughs> uh, tell me, like, what was the process like for um, making Ogeji? That is now a monster hit. Um, there was nothing really, like, we just went to the studio. We're just like, vibing. Have, have, we, we had this mindset that, okay, we want to, like, make something different. Mm. Something, like, if people hear, if people listen to you, they will, like, vibe. Mm-hmm. Not just normal songs. Um, we, ju- we just kept on trying different beats and okay. we just chose this one. We chose Ogechi this particular beat. Yeah. beat. Gyration beats. Mm. Yeah, we were specific about gyration, Sha. <laughs> <laughs> and so um, this was re- released exactly when? The Ogeji, when exactly was it released? I think it's like three months ago, four months ago. Okay, okay, okay. And yeah. so when you chose the beat and you sang you, you felt in your heart that this is going to be a hit or you just said let let it be what it will be you know you don't you don't you, you can't tell you just have to like hope <laughs> Hup, yeah put in the work and hope that's what we did we just mm-hmm. like recorded the song the next day the song was ready we dropped it and tiktok was there we had to like push on tiktok mm-hmm. that's that was just that was everything so what was the feeling like when you noticed that this had become like them we have to like pull more through <laughs> 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 I have to go extra miles in, like, pushing the OP. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so did you have that moment where you were like, oh, my goodness, our song is, is, is like a really, a, yeah. it's really a jam for people? Yeah, because I went, I went to this place to get food, and I heard this song. I was just like, uh-uh. I'm going to see I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I was hiding my face. <laughs> you know what? There's something 
Dami used to tell us, hey, my artists don't blow. So I'm wondering whether he was, hey, my song don't blow. Every day, that's what he tells. When he works with an artist and that artist, you know, makes that breakthrough, he's it always happens. excited. It happens like yeah. That. And then the DeVito feature came in. How yeah. did that happen as well? I mean, DeVito like I is it, like DeVito. I swear, like, everything just happened with. It's good. I, it's I, I, good I don't happened. know what to say. I'll just say it's good because. I don't even know how it happened. How. <laughs> I, say, it was, I just got a code from like Boy P and he, and he was saying I should like rush down to Chief Priest's house, Kobana mm-hmm. Chief. I don't even know him. Yeah. Yeah. So I went to the house. I met the video there. I was I was shocked. I was happy mm-hmm. at the same time. I don't even know how to like feel. Wow. Different feelings. And he was like, I know you now. Your brother did dance for me. I was like, ah, <laughs> boss. <laughs> Oh, that we was the same day we went to the studio that night waited for him at the studio he came he recorded the verse and the song was ready the next day and we asked like drop it everything just happened like everything was just like because like, I, <laughs> I remember when i heard the remix i was looking for like the official audio on uh, youtube and you you noticed well, that you a lot heard the remix first before the no i think no i had I had okay, the okay, original uh, one, uh, and then I had the remix too. Uh, the remix was just around the wedding during yeah, that time. Yeah. So I was looking for, I was hoping to see the video. I don't think you released a video for the main one. Was there a video nah, for it? Nah. There wasn't. So I kept looking. I was like, ah, where is the video? I couldn't find it. But I noticed that a lot of people had put their own, you know how people do yeah, these things. Yeah. It'll be like an official video. Go and check in. It's not that. But I mean, the song was a banger. And well, it's, I, it's, it's still a banger too, so... And finally, you put out the video too. What was yeah. the process like to? For when did you shoot the video? Around the wedding? Nah, I, I think like, like the next week. The next week, yeah, okay. after the wedding, because the video had like, he was saying he wanted to rest the wedding stuff. He wanted mm. to like chill, so we we gave him time. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, when oh. he was ready, he just texted us and that's it. <laughs> okay, so um, since then, how has everything been like for you? Everything has been moving. I don't know. I don't know how to see this, but by like the grace of God, it's been going smoothly. Yeah, it's been going smoothly. Things changed. It's not like before. Now you can't walk around the street and buy a car. I don't. I don't. Nah, I, don't go, I don't buy food. <laughs> you I can't was, buy a car. I also beg my other brother to please. If you are going, let me get this. Let me get that. <laughs> don't worry. I'll send you the money. <laughs> and are your parents and siblings treating you differently ever since you became such a hit maker? Or they are still making my you parents, do. Yes. Like it's not my. They are so. He will not be treated like his style. Like uh, they don't know they have a huge style in their house. <laughs> they know, but I mean, they I give you <laughs> okay. You still have to do the dishes. Of if course. <laughs> I mean, that is what makes you human, yeah. you know? Because sometimes those are the small things that will keep mm-hmm. us in, in, in check. And so now, after Ogeji, what next and what are the plans for you? Okay, I so we I plan on dropping something. We dropped constantly. I don't know if okay. you've you listened to that one. I haven't listened to that one. I'm, I'll it's, go and listen to it. You have to listen to I'll it. <laughs> <laughs> we job constantly I'll, and it's okay. going. We are, we are still pushing. Trying to like introduce the other work we have. We are still dropping songs though. Okay. okay. Then I'll drop after this whole thing and I'll, I'll drop my project. Okay. Yeah, my single, my EP. You do an EP. Yeah. Okay. This is why our artists a lot a lot of artists moving towards, you know, the EPs compared to and I, you see a number of them doing EPs and then subsequently put in an album. Some people don't even do albums at all, but they just do like four, five, six yeah, tracks for Yeah, seven EP. songs, yeah. Mm. I, I think that's how it works in it the works, industry. Yeah. I mean, okay, I you guess to, like, because of the times we are in. You have work first mm. for them to like, listen to more of you. Okay. I feel, I feel that's how it works. Okay, that's great. So, any future plans or... Yeah, a lot of plans. I just want you guys to like listen out, like watch out for me because I'm coming. I'm taking over Ghana soon. Hey, <laughs> I take you to Ghana away. Ah, they carry <laughs> everywhere. I carry every day. All right. I mean, we are happy to have you. We see that a lot of our Nigerian brothers love it here, and sometimes it feels like if the hit is a hit in Ghana, then it is like you know extra <laughs> extra saucy. But yeah, it's it's good. To I'd like yep. to know what are you doing? What are you, what will you be doing in Ghana whilst you? How long are you here for? I think six days or six five. days and today's day one yep okay, okay i'll be touching down like a couple places in Ghana. i don't really know how to pronounce it but i no, think one is I, truth, I will pub, teach you. truth pub um aguena sweju oh jesus <laughs> <laughs> i don't know if i pronounce it aguna <laughs> oh aguna you, aguna you guys have to like teach me more language aguna i need to learn okay. your language aguna swedru. and then where again mm, ah, i forgot the name <laughs> 
<laughs> we'll manage with that one. Yeah. At least so you'll be touching bases in different yeah, parts yeah, of, the, yeah. of the country whilst yep. you're here. All right. We wish you all the best. Thank you. Thank you, you and your entire team. And continue to make amazing music. All right. Thank you so much. Yeah, sure. All the best. Thank you. Thank you.